if you haven't already done so, it's recommended that you watch the videos on basic selection techniques and colour masking before you watch this video. The Select a Chain of Entities command lets you select entities that are joined together in a chain or a line. Selecting this green line, for example, so it results in the chain of lines all being automatically selected. Selecting this yellow line results in the entire chain of entities being selected, even though the chain is made up of lines, arcs and curves, and they are of different colours, styles and weights. The important thing is they are all joined together. It doesn't matter which entity in the chain you select, all entities will be selected. Click your right mouse button to stop the command. This command is particularly useful where it might be difficult to select entities using other techniques. For example, trying to select all these entities using a normal selection window results in these green lines being selected also. They would have to be deselected. Using the chain technique is much quicker and easier. If there is a branch in the chain of entities, you will be prompted for which branch to follow. Selecting this red line does not automatically select all the lines because there is a branch part way along and either could be correct. Here, RealCAD has tentatively selected the green line and is asking should it trace this path. Select Yes to continue along that path, or select No to have RealCAD check for the other one. Other selection masks can be used in conjunction with the chain. For example, the colour mask could be used to exclude green entities from the selection, and then the chain command won't see the branch and the lines like before. Similarly, the shift key can be used to add entities to the selection or to remove entities from the selection. That completes this tutorial.